Hey YouTube, Jordan here, and I'm showing this Apple MacBook Pro mid-2010 13.3 inch notebook. So, let's go ahead and go over the ports here. A latchless design, which I do enjoy. Um, sleep light, which is in sleep mode. The um, Apple remote sensor, which they don't have on these computers anymore. Um, line in an audio out port, SD card slot, 2 USB 2.0, mini display port, FireWire 8, 800, um, Ethernet, and MagSafe power jack. On the other side, yes, a Kensington lock and a DVD. CD and DVD-RW Superdrive, and no fan in the middle. I don't want to show that personal information. It gets the uh, it gets the mult. Come on, stupid! There we go. It gets the multi-touch trackpad, which. Pretty nice. So, yeah, you can do different stuff, which I do enjoy. Dashboard, um, launch pad. Alright, so let's go to the basic stuff I got on here. I got mail, the eye calendar, which is the 29th. Um, Safari, got the latest version of Safari running on it. iTunes 10.7, the latest version running. Um, go ahead and play. Oh yeah, copyright. Um, but there's all my apps. I have school apps, um, book, some podcasts, some TV shows movies and a whole bunch of music my priority there um let's go to safari and show you how fast the internet's on this thing pretty quick not bad there's wiley today's youtube channel um let's go to my channel actually let's go to um apple's website they yeah, pretty quick internet not bad pretty fast scrolling as well um, here's photo booth. And I got the little eyesight camera up there. So there's me filming with my iPod touch. So let's just take a picture. There's me. Um, and video on it, it's pretty good. So there's, so there's me, there's me with my iPhone, um, videotaping myself there. GarageBand, it comes with, uh, GarageBand 2009. I'm not worthy of upgrading to the iLife 2011. 09's the personal best for me. Well, so yeah. There, there's GarageBand. Yeah, it's telling me get my life eleven. Who cares? Really don't want it. So yeah, comes with my photo, two thousand nine and I movie two thousand nine. Um, here's system preferences, general stuff, security. This is stuff. That's been paired to this computer on Bluetooth. Got a wireless mouse. My um, iPhone. My iPad. My mom's mobile phone. And my old Sony phone that I used to use. So I got my iPhone, which I do enjoy. Show you the screensaver here. My favorite one of all time would be the beach. 
So, there's the beach. That's my old time favorite screensaver of all time. Don't know why. So, yeah, and the Macintosh hard drive. 243.2 gigabytes, and it has 164.13 gigs free. And I don't have a time machine. But, yeah, backups. Don't know why it decides to back it up, but who cares? Um, I have address book, the app store, the developer tool, which I never use, calculator, chess, clean my Mac. It, it cleans it up. Um, highly recommend this program as well. It recovers a whole lot of disk space. If you have a whole bunch of crap stored on your computer. Um, dashboard, dictionary, got the DF DVD player, got an easy, easy audio converter, which converts audio tapes and LP records, which is kind of cool. Got FaceTime, font book, garage band, um, got some help packard stuff for my help packard printer. I chat which I never know I don't know how to use. I DVD image capture iTunes mail. Got Microsoft Office two thousand eight edition. Um we'll go on to Microsoft Word. So there's Microsoft Word and I can type oops. Hey YouTube. I don't want to save it. Um, but it also comes with other stuff. The Microsoft Excel on the PowerPoint, which is cool to have. Uh, Mission Control Preview comes with QuickTime Player. Um, I do have this program called Sony. Sony. Come on, stupid camera. I got Sony Bridge for Mac for my old Xperia Play, which I hardly ever use anymore. Got text edit. Toy Story 3, that's a pretty good game. And I got the basic stuff for everything. <laughs> so, I'll show you about this Mac. It's running. Mac OS X 10.7.5 Lion. I'm not trustworthy of upgrading the Mountain Lion. Um, it gets a 2.4 gigahertz Intel Core 2 Duo processor with 4 gigs of DDR3 memory, which is sweet. And it got a Macintosh startup for the Macintosh hard drive. Um. It gets an NVIDIA GeForce 320M with 256 megabytes of video memory. Yeah, 13.3 inch, 1280 by 800 display, which is pretty good display. Um, it comes with a 250 gig SATA hard drive, which is good enough. Um, but I got my time machine back up, which hardly ever use. Um, it gets the DVD, uh, Super Drive with it, and the two gig slots and every, and same slots. Um, but it does run good, I got it connected to my Wi-Fi, and it's running off the charger. This, it came with the original charger, still using the original charger. I got frail, frail, frail cable on it, and why not get the Apple logo on the back? All right, I'll show you its box. I've kept the box. I always keep a box if I get a new computer or something like that. Well, here it is: the MacBook Pro, 13-inch LED backlit widescreen key notebook. I almost called it a keyboard. Um, as you can tell, Mac, yay, um, high photo, 
I move the garage ban up. Doesn't come with iWeb. I got he got rid of that when I went to um Ryan. Advancing NVIDIA and great graphics and a precision unibody enclosure, which I came out with when I first introduced this. And here's the specs 2.4 GHz Intel Core 2 Duo, 3 megs of shared L2 cache, level L2 cache, uh, 4 gigs of 1066 DDR3 SD RAM. 250 gig, 5400 RPM hard drive, 13.3 inch diagonal LED backlit glossy widescreen display. I hate that about glossy displays. Alright, camera needs to focus. Come on, camera. You can do it. There you go. Yeah, 1280 by 800 pixel. NVIDIA 3 GeForce 320M graphics with 256 megabytes of DDR3 SD RAM shared with the main memory. Built in iSight video camera. 8x slot loading DVD, DVD plus RDL. C DVD plus RW and CDRW CD drive, mini display port, SD card slot, FireWire 800 port, and two USB 2.0 ports, optical audio output, analog line out, built in stereo speakers, which is nice. Um, it gets the built in 10, 100, 1000 base T Ethernet. That's the built-in airport extreme wireless networking, 802.11n, and Bluetooth 2.1 plus EDR. Backlight keyboard with ambient light sensor. Pre-installed with Mac OS X and iLife 09. Size and meets energy star requirement. And you can probably tell from this picture. Camera needs to focus on it. It came with originally Snow Leopard, which was a very good op op operating system until I, until I upgraded. So, I'll show you. Yeah, I took most of this out. Put that in there. And I get the um, installation man. Well, installation CDs. This is what I mostly keep in here. I got the cleaning cloth and the manual as well. I, Got another thing in here. I don't know why I put it in here, but yeah, I still got the original CDs with it. I still got the um, 13-inch MacBook Pro CD. Well, with macOS version 10.6.3, I think that's what it originally came with. I think. And it comes with the other CD here, the um, application CD, which is cool. And I'll show you for a little bonus treat. Yeah, I love padded stuff. All right, let's stick this back in. I was so excited when I got this. I got back in 2010. I was so excited. Um, there's its, there's its case way back there in its other case. <laughs> but this is what a wireless card used to look like. Probably don't see these any, anymore. These old Apple Airport cards that go with the older machines. That review of that computer right there is coming up soon. Real soon. Um, yeah, but this one's from 1999. It, I have one right in that eMac. I got two. I got one extra in case something goes wrong. But, so yeah, that is the review of the Apple MacBook Pro mid-2010 13-inch.
So comment, rate, and subscribe, and see you guys later.